First of all, you are now part of a great villain's family. Yeah. Beginning with Joss. Right. Well, beginning Joss. with kind of Aja. Well, yeah. the big guys. Yeah. Oh, the big guys. Absolutely. Yeah. Of course. Yeah. They are always the villains. So sure. They are the big guys who right. fun. How do you feel about that? I uh, feel pretty great. <laughs> it's really, it's a cool thing to be, you know, mentioned in the same breath as uh, Job or as Jaws. But it's also a really cool thing um, to be that guy because they wanted to bring back that certain type of uh, mm -hmm. very classic James Bond henchman who, you know, was for the most part silent. Mm -hmm. And it was kind of, it's kind of a humbling thing, you know, to think of all these actors, all these guys that they want me to, to bring that the character back. And it's, it's, it's a pretty humbling thing, man. It's pretty, I, I feel... Yeah, very proud. What were you when you been or received the call that you are in the movie? Well, when I when I first got the call for the audition, uh, I was at home, <laughs> and I was pretty excited. What was your audition? Breaking yeah. something? Break? No, my audition was actually to recreate a scene. Um, it was a torture scene from Casino Royale. Oh. Uh, Le Chief, the torture scene, yeah. <laughs> the very brutal torture scene. Yes. So that was my audition. I, I recreated that, and it was a very dialogue heavy mm -hmm. uh, audition. So I didn't know anything about the character. I, I only knew about the uh, the nature of the character after my first meeting with Sam, which was a while after I auditioned. And then, even after I had the role, I didn't have the script, so I didn't know really anything. And when I read the script for the first time, was when I really became excited. Do you like rehearsals? Obviously, the rehearsals are the most yeah. important for your sense. Yeah, you know, it's weird. Um, I used to not really be all that into rehearsals. I always felt like kind of save it for the mm -hmm. moment when you're shooting, the beat, live in the moment. But I've come to appreciate rehearsals more and more and more as projects go. And I recently did, I did a, a small part on a film, and I shot a very large part in a very short time. It was two days, mm. and we had no rehearsals. And I was dreading, and dreading the day, man. I was like, I wish so badly that we had time to rehearse because it really, I mean, the pressure on. I really realized how much more difficult it mm. is when you don't have that rehearsal time. How many days took the? train sequence to shoot? Um, it, weeks, yeah. Weeks. It may have been uh, a couple of weeks. A yeah. couple of weeks. Yeah, and it was one of those things also when we started shooting that scene in the beginning of uh, filming, mm -hmm. uh, and we had to come back towards the end of filming uh, because Daniel got hurt during the scene when we just started shooting. I think we were like a couple days in. In your scene? Yes, in the fight scene. So mm -hmm. he uh, hurt his knee. Uh, he had ner knee surgery in the mid middle of filming uh, Spectre. And then we came back to that scene uh, at the end and he was still suffering. He taped it up and wrapped it up and bandaged it up. And we just c continued on with the scene, but it was a really hard, long, painful scene to, to finish. In a fighting scene, in all your career, what do you prefer, stunts or actors to work with? Um, actors, yeah, actors. I mean, in films, actors. Mm -hmm. um, because, I mean, at the end of the day, that's what I want to do. I want to I wanna act, I want to work with other actors, I want to work with, with great actors, mm -hmm. because you know, I, even same with wrestling, I always felt like when, if I worked with Triple H, if I worked mm -hmm. with Undertaker, those big names, very successful actor or wrestlers, I mean, that's when you become better. I mean, those mm -hmm. guys just pull you up, man. They mm -hmm. drag you up, they make you better, they they pull the best out of you, and it's the same with acting. You know, the the better actor you work with, uh, more respected, more established, uh, the better you become. You know, they make you better than you thought you could be. You know, and it's, it's a learning experience. It's a craft that you have to learn and you have to perfect. Thank you very much. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. All right, nice appreciate you. it. Yeah. Thank you.